Hey, I'm Andy Allardort, and in today's lesson, we're going to be going in deep with Dimebag Darrell Abbott from the band Pantera. The late, great Dimebag Darrell, certainly one of the greatest metal guitar players, one of the greatest guitar players that ever lived. And in this in deep lesson, we're also going to be covering how to play a song that's transcribed in this issue, a new level. And one of the first things with Dime is the tuning that he would use. Uh, his normal tuning was down a half step, but then raised on the chromatic tuner an additional 40 cents. So another way to think of that is instead of being tuned down a half step, you're tuned down a quarter step. It's in between. Just as Daryl's normal tuning was a quarter tone flat, when he tuned down a whole step, that was a quarter tone flat as well. It gets a little confusing, but a good way to do that uh, is to tune down a whole step and then tune down an additional 40 to 50 cents on your tuner, which is how I have the guitar tuned now. You can think of it two different ways. You could also think of it as being tuned down a step and a half and then being 40 cents higher than that. So in essence, it's in between being tuned down a whole step and being tuned down a step and a half. All right, so if I pick my A string, It's going to come up as G, but it's a hair flat. So as I was saying, for a walk and for a new level, he's tuned down a whole step plus a little bit more. So when the string settles, moving around a little bit, it's somewhere around 40 cents below. Here's the D. Same thing, you can see it as about 40 to 50 cents lower. So it's right in between. All right, so to make it as easy as possible, I'm gonna give you the pitches and you can tune your guitar up to this guitar and this will be in tune with the recording. The very first thing you hear on the song New Level is a pick scrape that Daryl does and he has an echo device set very wet so you hear a lot of echo repeats. Uh, it's a relatively slow in between, it's not like a fast slap back, um, it's a little bit slower than that uh, and then there are multiple repeats and that sounds like this. So all I'm doing is, as I'm rubbing the edge of the pick, with the guitar set on the bridge pickup, I'm just basically rubbing the edge of the pick against the, the G and the B string. Like that. And then I move down a little bit as I do it. 